you guys. So it's spring here in Barcelona and it's really lovely outside. And a while back I came across the idea of weathergrams. The American calligrapher Lloyd Reynolds used to make weathergrams and the idea is to take a piece of paper, write something seasonal on it and then hang it outside to weather. So today I'm gonna make some weathergrams and then hang them outside and let me know in the comments if you follow along and do this too because I would love the idea of weathergrams hanging all around the world. So traditionally you would use some like brown shopping bag paper but I'm gonna use this handmade cotton paper because it's just lovely. I'm gonna make it into kind of a skinny rectangle by using this technique where I use a water brush to kind of wet the paper and that creates like kind of a natural, not really deckled, but kind of deckled edge. So now I have two skinny rectangles. The spring also starts the peak tourist season in Barcelona and outside of my apartment there are always people who are kind of lost and looking for um, a popular tourist site that I live kind of near. And so I wanted to make quotes about traveling to kind of reward people who do get lost and who maybe enjoy getting lost. Traditionally, you would write the main text in black sumi ink with the first letter uh, for some contrast in a waterproof red. Here I'm using iron gel, which is also waterproof, and a Rocher and Klinger uh, waterproof uh, Bordeaux colored ink for the first initial. A lot of lovely weathergrams have at the bottom a Japanese hanko um, stamp in red. I don't have that, so I'm going to use like a little random tree stamp I have. I think it looks quite lovely. And then I'm going to fold over the top um, and punch a little hole in it. So that gives me a place to hang my string and that's where I'm going to hang it from the tree later on. I'm using a brown waxed thread so hopefully that's going to be durable enough to last for a while. I really want to hang these outside and then come back to them later and find them still in the tree. I don't know if that's going to happen but I wrote out another quote this time in a landscape format with the same materials. I believe Lloyd Reynolds preferred to keep his pretty short, like under 10 words, and it would be something seasonal, and he would hang them out uh, between the solstice and the equinox for three months. On an unrelated note, I really like writing Unseal because uh, there are no majuscules or minuscules, it's all one case, and I kind of feel that's how the English language should be. I feel like we should just choose between having one of punctuation or capital letters. But I don't know, maybe this is blasphemy to say as a calligrapher. So now I have my weathergrams ready and I'm going to do the exciting thing of finding somewhere in public to secretly hang my weathergrams. I didn't want it to be too public because I wanted to come back in three months and see if they are still there. But I think one of my favorite things about doing this project was going outside and trying to find like little secret places and seeing calligraphy out in the open is kind of like art bombing public spaces. Please do let me know if you do this or try this or intend to and as per usual, all the information about stuff I've talked about is in the description box below. Thank you for watching and if you liked it, please give me a thumb and subscribe if you'd like to. Thank you.